Hi everybody, it's me, Belinda. Um, this is kind of an update. Really haven't been gone that long. Update slash, uh, haul. <laughs> um, I'm just coming to you today. Um, I don't, my, my subscribers have come to kind of a standstill. It's not, I'm not ignoring anybody. Um, I mean, I think, I don't know if it's the weather, I don't know what it is, but I kind of at a standstill. <laughs> um, don't get me wrong, I love the community, I love the nails, um, but I think, I don't know, I don't know what clinically depressed is. I guess that's where I'm at. I um, burst out crying <laughs> over nothing, which I'm starting right now. <laughs> um, and I have nothing to cry over. My life is good. My children are healthy. Sorry. Have a husband of 19 years. Very rough. Many, many, many years. But now we're in a good place. Um, he supports me. enough so I don't have to work I mean he spoils me I usually whatever I want I eventually get it I don't know I guess I, the blue bug just bit me I don't think I've ever had it this bad but yeah <laughs> I don't mean to make anybody sad or pity me, believe me, please don't pity me. Like I said, I get mad at myself because there's so, so many things out there that are a million times worse than just me being depressed. There's babies dying, there's babies sick, there's families homeless, families sick. That's why I get so upset at myself that I feel even remotely blue or depressed about anything. But um, that's kind of why I've not, I've not been making any videos. I just haven't gone out buying. I haven't done things. I'm trying to focus myself on other things. Um... Yeah, <laughs> but I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the sob story because it's not a sob story. Um, and I'm sure that's not what you want to be listening to. So, um, yeah, that's that's been me. <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I'm getting there. And, okay, on with the haul, I guess. Um, sorry about that. Um, today in the newspaper... There was a $1 coupon, and it said $1 off of any Fergie Wet n Wild nail polish or any other Wet n Wild nail polish. Well, we bought, uh, I believe, nine papers. So I went and got the ones that are normally $0.99 cents at Walgreens. So, yeah, I've got a few of them to show you. I got this one in Metallica. This one in Baiju Blue. This one in... 
Come on, you are focusing beautifully right now. Oh, I can't even see that one. It says lavender pearlescent. That's so weird. My camera was focusing really pretty right now. I got this one in wild card. Invitation. That's kind of weird. Then I've got this one in Burgundy Frost. That's real pretty. I've got this one in Red Red. Ooh, this sparkly one. Very holographic sparkle in Kaleidoscope. And this pink glitter one in Sparked. And this, I don't know what color it's showing y'all, but it's a really pale pink in Tickled Pink. So yeah, all of these absolutely free. If I had more newspapers, I'd have bought more. <laughs> so that's what I got at Walgreens today. And let me show you a couple things. I think I went to Target and Michael's. So at Target, you know how their one spot usually has different little, see like the dollar and the pink dot? Well the pink dots and I believe it said orange triangles are 70% off. So I bought these for my son. He's a third grader but he still has issues with math. He's counting with his fingers and he shouldn't be. Oh well, no I'm sorry he's a fourth grader. He shouldn't be, so I want to kind of give him these little quizzes. Uh, that one's addition, that one's just a challenge. Um, this one's multiplication, and I grab these books too. That's a division book, a subtraction book, and a multiplication book. Each of these were 30 cents, so I thought that was a steal. And I guess that's all I got at Target. And I went to Michael's. Oh, no, no, one more. I found one little glitter pack. These were also 30 cents. So I don't know if y'all remember these. These were the only two colors they had. But, I mean, 30 cents for those two little tubs, that's not bad. So then I went to Michael's, and I thought this was pretty cute. I wanted something. I want to try, try my hand at other kind of um, crafts and such so I was thinking of making some cards with that that or some let me show you what else I got so I got the cards I also got they have their open stock paper for six for a dollar so I got some different little different little they don't have much fall or Halloween right now so I got different other things I'm even thinking of making a smash book I'd really like to make that, or maybe with just my own journal or composition book, add some little things. I don't know. Like I said, my head's everywhere. That's a black. That's. Whoops! There goes everything. See how these shine? There's that one, purple and red. Yeah. So, trying to figure out some different things to keep myself occupied busy so I got that at Michael's and I also picked up this big old bag of 13 13 little bags and reason for that is um, my girlfriend and I are throwing a favorites party I don't know if any of you have seen that on Pinterest but if you have um, and you're interested I'll tell you how it goes and if you haven't and you're interested, um, message me and I'll tell you about it. But it was, it seems like a lot of fun. So we have about roughly eight ladies have decided, have decided to go. And we have about 11, 
on the invitation, so we're hoping they all go. But yeah, it's called a favorites party. Excuse me. Like I said, I found it on Pinterest, and it just seems so fun. And a last thing I did at Michael's. Um, oh, this was a... Sorry. I used my 50% off on these, and I really can't remember how much they were. This was in the Studio G section, so that was a dollar. And like I said, the open stock paper, that's six for a dollar. All the 59 cent ones, well, they're now 16 cents. Um, the last thing I got at Michael's was this. Oh, I don't think. Out of frame. Let me see if I can hold the camera and not mess it up. That pumpkin, it's regular, I think, $15. And it's just, it's a, like a vinyl hard plastic. I don't know, not hard plastic, vinyl, like foam. And, um, because they're now advertising at, um, Michael's that they'll cut your, um, sorry, that they will carve a pumpkin for you. But it is really expensive. This is what they're doing. Um, like these suckers can come up to like 40 bucks. So my husband was like, I can do that, I can do that, you know, you know men. <laughs> so my husband was really, really sweet, and he said, if this turns out good, I'll buy you a bigger one. I think they're $25, so it'll be $15. i will buy you a bigger one, and we can make it more unique. So this is what he made me tonight. He carved it up for me, so I thought that was cool. It's something you can keep from now on and just put away instead of the real ones that go rotten you gotta throw it away so yeah that's what my that's that was my husband's project tonight i think he did wonderful <laughs> um thank you ladies for watching my little haul and hearing my little whine i'm sorry about that but i, pr I appreciate you all and i really really enjoy watching y'all's videos y'all get me get my mind off things and um I hope I do the same for you all, and I hope you enjoy my videos. Um, again, thank you all for watching. Bye.